there's a cross there. I am carving of wood here. I don't know if you can see it, yes. Just carving of wood. And I'm in a beautiful town called Delegra. Oh, sorry, uh, whatever. <laughs> uh, called whatever. And uh, I, I was stopped by the police. I was stopped by the police and uh, the paranoia, you know, starts. You, you just uh, think, here we go, this is the end for you. <laughs> uh, they will put you in jail, even though you have done nothing, of course. Except having a brain and uh, and putting videos on YouTube, for example. But then you realize that I go every every time I go into city, guys, every day in the, into a new city. Well, sometimes if I don't find where to sleep, you know, I have to to go through many cities. Uh, that rarely happens. So when I go to a city, guys, I always recharge my phone with new videos I recharge from YouTube but think about it these videos are free guys these videos and, and this is very telling if oh sorry for the 666 uh, Hans Wormer uh, this is very telling the fact that I'm getting all this information that people around YouTube you know that I really admire like I really suggest this channel guys slave new world subscribe the guy is very very smart and uh, talks about the transpocalypse and how all also this virus is connected with that because when you you try to make someone a tranny guys he will not reproduce in the same way they will inoculate the sheep the sheep you know with the virus that will render them uh, sterile so it's the same thing trans virus is the same agenda so now think about the fact that I get all this information of research that these guys have done you know and I collect them and it keeps me alive during these days I mean the place here is beautiful guys I mean you can uh, just by watching here it's uh, it just recharges you but uh, but I, I need I need also a rechargement for my spirit, you know, and so the fact that it, I am able to get it for free, this invaluable for me information, this means that the people around us guys are totally blind, such as the the people that control us can let this information be there free, freely available, guys. The only thing I do I go to the next town, and there is free Wi-Fi everywhere usually the best one is on the postal office so I hang around hang around uh, near to the postal office and I get you know the latest videos and I download them is there anyone coming well maybe who cares they are sheep you know the, I just I just was uh, uh, I remember when I was a lefty, guys, a dumb, totally lost, you know. I, I used to watch Zizek. And I remember he, him talking about slavery. Uh, it, it, was, it, it was such that if two white people were uh, having sex in a room, for example, with a prostitute, whatever, if a black guy entered, they would not even stop to have sex because they would consider, like, a cat just entered in, in the room and uh, in the same way I am now with the sheeple guys if I see a sheeple it's like seeing an <laughs> a sheep guys it doesn't uh, I used to be more you know you know when you realize these are not human guys these people are lost please watch one of the the latest videos that this guy did uh, studying a verse in the Bible, guys. It's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. And, and it made me realize this, that these people, because I was talking, I talk all the time with people in the street, guys, trying to, to tell them uh, all these lies and everything. But you just realize that they do not care, guys. They don't care. And so in the Bible, 
he uh, made the connection. In the Bible, repeatedly, God said that he, it gives to people that do not want to listen to God more confusion. So right now, guys, these people are freaked out, completely, completely going right in the, in the hands of the, the monsters because they do not really choose to be blind. The information is all there, but it's, it, uh, it doesn't have a value. So how come I, I'm, I'm taking all these pearls, you know, in YouTube? I'm taking it because, you know, it's like you, you can put money everywhere if people around you are, are, are blind. Nobody can steal your money, okay? The same thing. And so, but my paranoia, you know, was like, uh, okay, this guy stopped me and uh, please be calm, you know. They check on you. They take your ID and uh, the first thing you would think to yourself, well, I have the right, you know, to, to tell them, well, fuck you. Did I do something wrong, you know? Why uh, do you want my ID? Which was something that I did long ago and... Uh, you know, it's it's uh they didn't do anything to me, but uh, it's it's painful. Uh, I was surrounded by police, by by military also that there were that was there in the train station. It happened in Achilia. So, uh, but you realize, guys, that the system doesn't care for an individual. Uh, they might deal with some that are so-called experts that realize everything is a lie and they switch, you know, change. So from being one approved expert, you change your mind and go to the other side, to the truth. They will not let you live, guys. But if a guy like me, you know, a conspiracy nut, as they would call us, you know, uh, just does its thing on YouTube, who cares? There are millions of us doing that there the other people around us do not care to listen to the truth you know so let them let them blindly go to the trap guys can you believe it, guys these guys can't wait to make the vaccine to, to take the vaccine so let them go there let them go it will be hard for us that's why you know i'm enjoying the last moment here on earth guys the, in this relatively uh, as trump trump said the quiet before the storm, you know, and now we know why he said it. And um, so, you know, they would ask you, where are you going? I'm doing a walk, you know. Can't you see, you know, I had the sticks and everything, my sleeping bags and whatever. But no, he had to check on me. And after he checked on me, he said to me, oh, have a nice uh, day, uh, have a nice uh, walk, you know, Camino, it's pilgrim, pilgrimage, how do you say? So, uh, this town here, guys, is called, why am I, why is this? sorry guys, sorry, I will not bother you with BS. Uh, and I'm going to the next town called whatever. So I was in whatever, and I will go in the next town called whatever, guys. You know, from one farm to another farm with sheep, guys, with dumb people. I met uh, since now the priest in uh, one, three, one day, three people, guys. Unbelievable. Then another one who was three. I, I, Four people I met so far that were smart. Ah, but also I have to, to, to make like a list. You know, uh, the uh, percentage is like with people you talk to and interaction you have. It's like one in a hundred, more or less, guys. Dumb people with intelligent people. This is uh, our reality, guys. Let's see what happens to the, this next town. And uh, tomorrow, uh, unfortunately, which, you know, tomorrow for me is tomorrow. But for you, I don't know when I will upload this video. Oh, I have a fighter there, guys. I don't know if you can see it. It's a fighter. You know, they, they have to... They are essential, guys, of course. 
man should always uh, train to kill man. It's very useful. Those are idiots, you know, that for money will kill. Think about it, guys. The elite, you know, does nothing, just gives us money, and we do the job <laughs> like dummies. You know, with this uh, Marshal or uh, Carabinier stopped me, which is like the sheriff, you know. People around him, you know. Hi, sheriff. How are you? <laughs> hi, hi. You know, I was there. You know, they would not bother to to even look at me. You know, <laughs> I was just a piece of shit. You know. These these are the sheep, guys. They hate justice guys uh, they love to suck dicks sorry for but uh, this is the sheep guys they deserve to be to be wiped out guys this is i i, I would uh, i was horrified to live with these monsters all my life guys all my life these filthy people so let's go to whatever do do you want to know <laughs> Are you curious to see whatever another farm of sheep out there? Let's go. I will go in the end of the day. I will be there now. It's it's like 10 o'clock, you know, and uh, Luckily camp trails are starting to make the sky gray, which is exactly let me do another 666 for a while <laughs> Hans uh, It's what I wanted, you know, because it's uh, It's beautiful this way. You, you don't get the Sun in your head You can walk much longer and so we're we're going to a town called Gerano, Gerino, whatever, whatever, man, whatever. So guys, I find myself in Gerano. <laughs> the name of the whatever is called Gerano, you know. Ente provinciale per il turismo. Oh, okay, no. So this is the place, and uh, the most important thing, guys, since you can see that I'm inside, and there is a bed there, which is what it counts for me. Uh, and also, guys, just for some instruction, look at the look at the blue red always. The mix of the two is purple, and the moon, you know, the female part. This is Mary. This is the crown, the corona, guys. Lucy is here, as always with us. Here we have some beautiful scenery, and here we have some snow. Here we have the virus, guys. The virus. This is what transmits the virus, guys. It doesn't transmit by air. So, uh, man, really rarely happens, you know, that uh, the the priest, you know, in a certain place, you know, is a, a great guy. He just gave me the keys for this whole uh, apartment here, which ha <laughs> which is very, you know, uh, simple, you know. Uh, but, but for me, this is like a luxury, guys, when I do things like this. There's also Mary there also to keep me safe. And, uh, and here we have the uh, Republic of uh, no, Bethlehem. Bethlehem. And the star here. Mm -hmm. The pentagram. Here we have an old school uh, mitophone, I will say it in Albanian. Who cares? Uh, here we have some stuff, and you know, guys, uh, it was amazing. You know, I have like three rooms here. This one is in better shape, and it's even cooler. Let me show you, because the roof is all in wood. Wood. Would you believe it? And here also we have the Mary. The Mary here also. A fan. Lots of fans. Lots of cracks. Let's hope the elite doesn't plan to uh, get rid of Gerano right uh, tonight. You know? But have you ever wondered why the earthquake always happen? Oops. Always happen in uh, when it's night. You know? How come? Very weird. Some maybe someday I will uh, understand that. So there is also the bathroom, guys. <laughs> it's, I don't know, man. I, I feel bad if I turn on the the hot water, you know. I don't know if I'm gonna do it. Maybe just a quick uh, washing here and there. So, and and over there, there's much more. But you know, guys, it, it was very cool uh, because I uh, when I was waiting for the mass, the mass, 
uh, to, to end, you know, so the priest can come out and I can ask him if he could let me sleep there. There is a boiler here. Yeah. I want hot water. And this one, guys, is an old school lamp, which is not LED LED. This is good, very good. They do not sell this anymore, guys, because it's the only one that doesn't, it's good for your eyes and everything. That's why, of course, they do not sell it. So, uh, you know, when I was waiting for the, this priest to finish the mass, you know, and luckily now you have to, like, uh, put a mask to, to do, do the mass and wash your hand and they check your temperature, guys. It's unbelievable. And in fact, there, is a, there was a kid there from Russia, guys, like uh, six years old or seven, maybe. Very, very great guy, you know, very curious, you know, and would ask me question. And, uh, and uh, when, when we were talking about the virus, I told him, these people are all crazy. Do not wear a mask. <laughs> and then after, and it was funny, I, I, if I had the GoPro, I would have registered all these moments, beautiful moments, really. You know, the congregation, some priests and, and other people around me, I told them, you know, jokingly, where is this virus? If someone doesn't, you know, if I don't see it, I don't believe it. And so they tell, oh, you are like St. Thomas. If you don't, uh, this is a thing. And, uh, but, but, but she said, but you should believe without seeing, which is something, you know, uh, refer to God. And I told her, yes, I believe in God, even though I don't see it because I can see the presence of God. But where is the presence of a virus? Only in television. Oh, man. So let's see just quickly in real time. Real time. What do we have up there? Ah, oh, there's a kitchen here. Let me see if we can. Uh, there's a place for the foyer. And there's a place to cook my um, inexistent meal, of course. Mm, what do we have here? The, the usual. So, I, I will not use this, of course. So, guys, mm, it went well, but there is some, some kind always of, uh, of uh, you know, um, it's like, you know, I, I'm departing for, for because I can feel uh, things are going very bad, you know, and uh, soon it won't be, I, I won't be able to to do this, that I was starting really to love, you know, to do these walks, and uh, you always meet, oops, you always meet new people and uh, see new places, and it would be really, well, it's not that I would not be able to do this. These monsters are planning to kill us, guys. It's not uh, something like here. So, I would salute you with this beautiful painting. Like, ah, oh, it's actually a picture. Better this way. Better this way. See you tomorrow, guys. So this is the view I get. I can't get out of them, you know. The Masonic Triangle there. And the cross with the, let's see, the rays of the sun. Yeah. And it's 7... 7... 7.07. Uh, Oh, look at the entrance, a, tri a triangle over there also, one up, the other one down. So, uh, and this is where I will eat, guys. Uh, we have the usual water. Uh, well, uh, I, I use this aluminum uh, container just in case of an emergency. Since I didn't find spring water on my other glass water bottle, I, I'm using this. So here we have uh, bread. Here we have tomatoes. Not rotten this time, thankfully. And uh, here we have olives, guys. Olives are very important. And uh, today I listened to, uh, to a video uh, by, uh, by a guy called... Uh, Joey Briano, that I really suggest. Um, apparently, olives are full of iron, guys, which is important in this uh, when they will attack us with this uh, 5G thing. And this is very unbelievable. Now, first of all, as you can see, guys, we are in a classroom here. 
this, this this place is really weird, guys. What can I say? But but hey, again, this is this place, guys. It's unbelievable. But again, it's always better than using a tent in the park, guys, as I did that, that day. You know, you get things like this here, guys, which, which, which you do not, you can't explain. What is this thing? Yeah. So, two oranges, guys. Since uh, you know, the, here in Italy, uh, shops are closed for like uh, one day a week, and it just happened that this one, this town, the, the day they chose to close is today every Thursday um, very lucky but again I do not complain the problem is that uh, I I had to, to shop in a bar a bar it only sells you know alcohol and uh, all toxic stuff and so they they sold me these oranges two oranges for one euro guys which in a, I, I could buy like a kilo with one euro and maybe even organic, if I'm lucky. But mm, this is what you get, guys, when, uh, when there is no choice. And you know, when, do you, when you will have no choice, guys, as they have done with us, you know, they have uh, took, took away slowly to us all choices. So the only choice, the only jobs, the only food is what they want. Now only big shops can open. What a dumb shit, you know. Soon uh, making a baby will be impossible, guys. The vaccine will uh, make us sterile. So, all this is done, you know, to get rid of us. Hopefully, the sheep will wake up. But I don't expect that, for sure. They keep amazing me all the time. Me from. Uh, the lovely classroom here. Yeah? Salute you. See you on the next one.